Hi everybody, Coach Dom Costa with episode 21 of Hustling for Cash Money with Metal Recycling. I want to give a shout out to two inspiring guys on YouTube. That's Mike the Scrapper. What great stuff he's got out there for tips and tricks and hustling to get that metal scrap. Another one is a gentleman named Kerry with Scrapping for a Dart. He's inspirational as well with his goal setting and I have a goal too. I have a daughter getting married in two years and I'm going to use all the money from my side hustles to pay for this wedding. And then we're going to pay down some other goals. We're going to get after it. Again, kids, this is just driving back and forth to work or in my own neighborhood, just going different ways home, and I find this stuff. And you can see me there. I even ended up in the, in the bumper uh, right here. You see me taking a picture of this load. And again, this is just a real quick one. It came about. And I don't like to leave too much of a fat load around me in the yard. But anyway... This one was a neighbor lady in my network. She had me come by a home she was cleaning out for sewing. This is an old sod roller full of water. They didn't know how to get the water out. Maybe I should have left the water in to have more weight. But we got that on the truck as well to add to it. And I want to show everyone too, get these great uh, straps, not metal straps, but great straps for your metal. Don't want to go bouncing down the road and have this stuff fall off and hurt yourself or hurt another vehicle and other people in it. Another tip to keep from... Uh, wrecking or making a mess in my own truck and putting those uh, waste particles out on the road is these five gallon buckets. I keep my smalls in there, the stuff that could get out and hurt someone else. And it's just a lot easier and you can carry more of it there. Another great tip kids, I like going to my scrap yard midweek during the middle of the day because end of the day, end of the week, weekends in Los Angeles, oh man, the scrap yard is like a reality show getting ready to be made. Some of that money is up to no good, and some of it's just paying the bills, but it's definitely a show to see here in Los Angeles, especially the harbor area, to see who's bringing in the scrap. Anyway, for a couple hours' work, just came to me. Piece of cake, 36 bucks is only four cents a pound. I could have, should have, would have, but it was mostly 10. Another shameless plug for my book, Scrapping uh, is a way for me to make money. Check me out on Amazon KDP. The links are below. You don't have to do minimum wage, kids. You can get your other side hustles and make that money and do what you want to do. Have those goals. Get after it, kids.